Hey guys, this tutorial will show you how to add VAT on purchases for a particular product using the WP ERP's accounting module. So from your ERP dashboard, go to Accounting, then go to Purchases under Transactions, then click on Create Purchase under New Transaction. Now set the vendor date, reference number, and address. In the next part, click a product from the drop down list, set the amount if needed, and most importantly, be sure to check the box for VAT. You can add more products if needed. Click on Add Line if you want to list more products. Now select the Purchase VAT zone from the drop-down list to apply the tax. Add a particular if needed. You can also attach a file if needed. Lastly, hit Save to finish. Click on the voucher number to see the full detail. The tutorial ends here, but if you don't know how to set the tax zone for your product, then follow these steps. Go to Tax Rates under Settings, then click on View Tax Zones and click on Add Tax Zone to add the tax zone before saving the settings. Now click on View Tax Categories and click on Add Tax Category to add your product category. Next, head to Products and Services under Products and click on Add New and set your product name, type, category, cost, and sale price. Now set the ownership of your choice and set the tax category which you had earlier set before saving your settings. Again, head to Tax Rates under Settings and click on Add Tax Rate. Now select a zone name, then set the component name, agency, and most importantly, the tax category and tax rate. Hit Save to finish. Just like before, head over to Transaction, Purchase New Transaction, and Create Purchase. Set the vendor name and select a product. If you select the VAT zone, you will see that the VAT amount will appear. And that is how you can add VAT on purchases for a particular product using the WP ERP's accounting module. For more videos on managing your business activities on your WordPress site, be sure to check out WP ERP and subscribe to our channel.